today we're really showcasing the capabilities being delivered to Army at the moment and being delivered to Army in the future. So you can get in and out of that. Here on display the, uh, the Land 400 contenders uh, as well as some in-service or coming into service equipment like the Hawkeye and the Supercat and so forth. What I really like about today, it's an opportunity to show uh, the retired generals of our Army uh, that their legacy endures, their good work uh, lives on, uh, their the intellectual input into what the Army should be into the future uh, is uh, in good hands and, uh, and this is what we're getting and it's an exciting future. Uh, and then looking at Maxio facial protection, so full facial shield. I think it's just a fantastic time for the Army to see this level of sophistication, this level of technology all set, ready to be introduced. It will really increase the capability of the Army uh, many, many times. It's fantastic to be able to show off the capability that you're delivering and potentially you're going to operate in the future. It's also been fantastic. We've had cadets come over from RMC and ADFA to look at the type of capabilities that are going to be in the Army when they graduate. As an Army, uh, as a government, uh, Australia is offering uh, our people uh, absolutely the best that's out there and they deserve that.